Alright, I'm going to use this battery to power the Blue Eddy, charge the Blue Eddy up tonight. Um, as you can see, it's at 83%. It's not hooked up here to AC power. I have this converter, 12 volt to 24 volt converter here. It's supposed to do up to 480 watts. We'll see how much we actually get. I'm thinking I'm gonna get max of 240 because this has a 10 amp uh, maximum and at 24 volts should be 240 watts max. You can see it's converting that battery which is right now at 13.3 volts to 24 volts. I'm going to plug in with a solar connector. Alright, might not get more than 184 volts or watts. So I guess keeping it at 8 amps. See I'm still slightly below 24 volts here. This is 193 watts. That's converting down to 184. So about 9 watt loss. Alright, 194 and now we're at 184. So that will charge as long as it needs to. have that going up to the main battery cables because that will only allow 10 amps max out of it and then I have it going to uh, Anderson 175 to an Anderson 50 amp fuel converter here and then got solar MC4 connectors to this and going down saying 1.8 hours to charge at this rate to full I'm gonna leave it plugged in all night we'll see what it's like in the morning um, whether the battery is completely drained or not I don't think it will be because once this reaches 100 it'll stop charging and then it'll just be come on when it needs to to keep it at 100% i noticed it goes down to 99% then comes back on. I do not think there's a setting to change that on this. Whereas the EcoFlow weighs it to like 96% or 94% to come back on. So, we'll leave that going all night. Turn that fan on right there. That should help draw some air across that, help keep that cooler. But this will be putting out about half of its capacity. Almost. But we'll see how it is in the morning and go from there. Um, the fat battery voltage on this battery is 13.3 volts. I think I've already said that. Um, and it's showing four bars on the top there. It's showing four bars here. It is 9.47 p.m. right now. So we'll see how it is in the morning. It's 8.33 the next morning. Power station is at 100%. And it looks like we got 900. 47.9 watt hours out of the battery. It is at one bar left. So that would easily double the time or power of this power station. And this is 
slightly warm to the touch. Which you could do the same thing without this. Probably save some power. But this will charge faster than just putting it directly to this. Um, so we got 39 amp hours out of it. So I guess at 12 volts that would be a little 40 or 80 amperes. 